All right, so today I wanted to cover a very simple Slack concept, and that is creating a post. Posts are something that sit on the Slack team and are searchable based on whatever share level you create. So today I'm going to create a Slack post about a Divi site that I developed for a client. You come down here to your little comment bar and you click the button. You've got three options. You can upload a file, create a text snippet, or create a post. This is going to take you over to the website where you generate your file. Uh, here we give it a name. I'm going to go ahead and give it somewhat of a naming convention. This is a client and the client is Prime Universal. I'm going to go ahead and create our H1 tag, the site. I'm going to create a text holder that I'm going to fill in with the link. And here we're going to type www.primeuniversal.com and hit enter. All right, so now we want to add an image, um, unless you want to use up some of the Slack team's storage space, which with a free group you only get 5 gig. The option is to grab a URL that points to the image, paste it in, and it converts it. So at this point we've got, our post has got a title, it's got an H1. Got a brief little write up on it, all the things I did with it. I could add more additional links. I could put together all sorts of things. You'll notice that out beside each paragraph area, you have a little paragraph mark that decides whether you're going to create a list or a numbered list or an H1, 2, or 3 or a checkbox for people to check off, or you want to input some code to share with other people. Okay, so we've got our post put together. Um, let's go ahead and make some adjustments. We'll change that to an H1. You can see you do that from the little paragraph symbol off to the side. We've got a regular paragraph here. I've created a link from it. Uh, we've got an image. Same thing was done there. We just created a URL to that image and it converts. Um, I've got what's technically usually reserved for code, but that's because I didn't want it to turn into a link. It's I wanted it to stay set text. And then we've got a basic paragraph description of the site. So now we're done. We click share. We choose where we want to share it, which channels or with whom we want to share it. I'm going to choose the member galleries. Then I'm going to add a comment. Brief comment to add in. Click share. And there we go. Now you'll notice when we hop back over here to the member galleries, We can look at the files, and here they are. I've got an example site I put together, as well as the Prime Universal one that I just built. And that's what it takes to build a post, and then share it on your Slack channel. Hope everyone enjoyed.